Hello. Hey guys, welcome back to Zelda: a Link to the Past. We. All right, this is gonna be fun, actually. You already talked to them, right? Uh, I don't. I don't need to. You just move on to the next quest. Yeah. Oh, okay. So it's not like they had a trigger of importance or anything. Let's see. That's uh, good. Map. Honestly, skipping dialogue is optimal. You know, because you're. Terrible person who doesn't want to show off the entire game, I mean, I guess. Yeah, of course. <sighs> yeah, I don't go to this area very much. Um, this one in particular, because look at it, it is weird. It's just about three stumps, some grass, that one red guy. I know this is a random thing to bring up, <laughs> and I'll never forget episode 42 of Emerald. Which one was that? Oh, it was the one on my mind. It was the, I think it's 42 or 40 something where like you drew the picture of uh, you getting chased off by fucking Team Magma members while Steve just doesn't look. Oh yeah, please Steven. Ugh. Yeah. He was a pain in that series. Yes, he was. Alright, so who? where are we going next? Uh, south. South? Yes. We're going to go get a book from the bookstore. Well, as other people like to call it the library, because they're fancy. Hmm, which one of these books do I want? Clearly not the one with the arrow in it. Yes. You wouldn't want that one. That one's stupid. I can't live this one. Hmm. Guess we'll take that one. Uh, Medora. Alright. Now with the Book of Medora on our hands, we'll head down. See that patch over there with the water? Not this patch with the water, but Terrible, this one. Terrible, sorry. Just bird crashed. Yeah. Right. We'll go I'm crash. back now. Oh. Anyway. <laughs> I am still sick. <laughs> so we're heading up north? Yes. Well, we're heading north to, so we can head down to east so we can go back south. Makes sense to me, Zelda. <laughs> so, keep pushing the wrong button. Alright, so, here we go. You pressed the wrong button! Uh, we can go cut through Hyrule to get there, I guess. And buy me Hyrule Castle. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> yes, I have to get another thing. <clears throat> Cough, cough. Dude, just, why don't you have a map out at this point? I, I, I have a map. I pull that every time I need to have a look at it, which is a lot. Yeah, but well, why don't you just have an actual map <laughs> actually next to you so you know which way to go? <laughs> the Game Boy Advance version didn't come with a map. <laughs> you know, it actually would have been kind of funny if you like actually played like a mode where you had to uh, bring a real map. Well, you, you mean had to Zelda actually mark shit down. <laughs> huh? You mean Zelda 1. Well, no, I mean, like, you actually, like, you got a real map of the land and everything, like, and then you just have to fucking figure shit out on your own. Yeah, that would be cool, I guess. If not annoying. I mean, if done right, it could be really cool. Hmm. I agree. Um, I feel like I missed it. Yep. I'm gonna go to the desert. Here we are, a place where we can get a free heart piece. <clears throat> cough, cough. Wait, really? Yeah. It's pretty free. First off, we can do this. Get some Took rocks. you a second. Uh, a second to do what? To like, I can. <laughs> I don't know, it's just kind of funny. It was like. When you push the block, you, uh, what is it? You just kept trying to push the block and it wouldn't do anything. Oh, hmm. like, uh, well, that was funny. Okay. Yeah, so by opening up the floodgates here, we kill a couple of fish and also this. Yeah, boom around. <laughs> yeah, but why do we hate, why would we like fish at all? Fish are dumb. Hmm. All they do is spit fire at you. 
That's true. Oh, are those things you need to collect? Oh, well, okay. I thought there were little like seat things you could needed to collect, like in a uh, link between worlds. Nope. <coughs> so that just means that you need to brutal the murder. Also vultures. And sand people. Sand people, sand people look like sand. Don't talk like people. Don't talk. Well, uh, they talk like Link. Anyway, we got a little uh, archery click on this first. Holographics here. All right, and how do you translate them? With a book or translation. <laughs> Seven the way forward. Make your wish here, and it will be granted. What is he doing? Uh, praying, I guess. The sprite looks so weird. I mean, he takes his hat off for it. Maybe as a sign of respect or something. I'm not sure. Come on, vulture friend, let's go. Vulture adventuring buddy. Oh. Everyone probably remembers these enemies from Ocarina of Time. The like likes? Yeah, like oh, likes. the pea hats. Yeah. Well, not specifically pea hats. Are they pea hats? Those are the ones in the sand. They're called pea hats, I believe. Okay, because I. Well, am I thinking of pea bodies for the, the big ones? Maybe. I never understand when I hold money. Besides, the whole mechanic of trying to get money makes sense. Maybe, maybe funding making all those demons cost money. Possibly. Ganon has to individually pay everyone. Oh, I'll stop rapid firing. Yeah, P hats are the big ones. Yeah. Okay. So these guys are. Let's see. I guess they're all named P-Hats. Really? Because they're definitely a different kind of species, really, because the other ones fly. Unless there's the flying variants. I mean, they still propel her around. Yeah. Okay. Well, you can jump off here and end up over here, which is great, because you can escape the dungeon that way. That's a really weird design. And now we have to pray again. Oh, uh, no, these are just much larger the whole time, apparently. Interesting. And the smaller ones are called larva, pea hat larva. Ah, the babies. Gotcha. Yeah. So all you guys got to do is stab them because they're weird fucking fruit things. Yeah. They are definitely weird. It's a good um word for them. Ow. Which makes you really think, like, what the fuck are these things? Really. Yeah. I mean, they grow in the sand, and then they... fly? This game's kind of... unnecessary. Like, the whole, um... The whole process is them out. Is them go from going to Earth to Sky. With no real reason between why. Key. This is where you would go to get the item that you really want to get. Wait, you need a key for that, so, uh, yeah. Yay. And look, more sand! How deep do you think the sand is here? Because you can see the wall tiles here, like the, the sides boundary, but the, the sand indicates that there's enough sand for things to hide underneath it, so... Hmm.
Yeah, this is a good time to get compass. <laughs> this doesn't even make any sense. It's actually hard to get out of here to get in. Ugh. <laughs> Also, I'm not sure about everyone else, but the Pegasus boots are just amazing. I love the ability to run. Yeah, everybody loves the Pegasus boots. Hmm. I don't know why. It's almost as popular as the hookshot. Yeah. Oh, so Botsky. Hmm. Oh, just stupid gloves. So bad. So bad. You know. Yeah. Everyone as he knows. would say. Everyone knows how bad it is. Oh, yeah. Definitely bad. Yeah. Suddenly I feel like to play some Ridge Racer. <laughs> you know, without the power gloves, you wouldn't have been able to lift those pots, man. Mm, those maybe. pots are not like the average pot. They're mm. really heavier than the average pot. Hmm. Do you think secretly that Links of the Fast was actually just a promotional game to promote new, um, Items that Nintendo will go release. What? So let's just say they'll go release these new items called the bombs to the general public, or these lantern things called lamps. Or even a bow and arrow. It makes sense, right? Well, the biggest. Well, to be fair, the be fair, the power glove is only for the NES, so you know. Yeah. It's a bit of late advertisement. Yeah, I guess. Oh, yeah, stop shooting at me. Don't you need to light those? <coughs> what? Don't you need to light those uh, candles? You can, but there's not really any point to doing so. What? Why? This isn't. Oh, hey, look at that. The tiles are going to attack us. Hmm, what could 8 mean? No, wait, they keep transforming. Let's just leave before we die. Wait, what did it mean? I don't know. It just mean the tiles were attacking us and my face hurts. <laughs> seems you don't get any heart, Tatum. Yeah, seems... These guys have money on them. It's more important than health. There's a light through the wall. <laughs> I was about to say, do the Vemos uh, instantly kill you or something? One health. Oh jeez, they're getting it. They're fucking angry. Where did I leave that key? Here it is. Yeah, pew, pew. You just see the two beams like shoot each other in the face. <laughs> More key I thought I hearts. was hitting him. I don't like this game. Ow. Do it. Not you. Get up so I can hit you again. Oh. How do you know his one weakness? Shooting him in his big eye? <coughs> I don't know. It's just... It just felt like it, really. Even You're so intuitive, he didn't. Hmm, very. They have weaknesses in video games? Is that the only way you can hurt them? <laughs> Even more? Ooh. Can you hear that? Yes. I'm sorry. <laughs> now watch as I completely botch this fight. I don't like this fight very much. 
I don't think anybody really likes this fight. We'll be right back. <laughs> Do 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 do. Oh, attrition! Damn it! I hate these rocks. <laughs> I don't know how that hit me, but okay. You did it. Oh, they shoot out more rocks when it's the last one. Desperation and all that. Which means I need to kill him quick, otherwise he's gonna kill me. There we go. I'm the health. Whatever. <laughs> Dude, it doesn't matter because you've got the heart container. Oh. Yeah. No, oh. It just doesn't heal you. <laughs> no, I thought it fully healed you like the other ones did. Nope. That's stupid. Hmm. Now I heal. Because the pendant heals. Oh, okay. <laughs> anyway, uh, oh, yes, the magic of the pendant heals you. Once right. only. Before we um, end this episode, I'm going to go grab to a fairy. Because that seems like a good idea. Beams. Did someone say Beamos? The most beamous of beams? It was just this one, wasn't it? Good job, Hayden. Thank you. <coughs> yeah, you caught a fairy, Hayden. I'll catch that no, one maybe too. you should set it free, just to be safe. I'll set this one free. Wait, right. no, keep it. No! We only have one bottle. Anyway, I'm Hank Gaines Freddy. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys in the next episode of Link to the Past. And I'm Cross Sock Dance, and I hope you come back for these, because these are pretty fun. See ya. See ya.